After my sophomore year, I decided that I wanted to try out plasma physics. Plasma physics was really interesting to me mostly because uh, its central problem is that of nuclear fusion, which could be a very um, important source of energy in the future. To actually make a fusion reaction sustainable as sort of an energy output, what you need to do is contain that reaction somehow. So there are two main ways to do this. One's called magnetic confinement, whereby you put a magnetic field um, sort of around in a loop. Then the particles will sort of spin in helixes um, all the way around the loops, and that will contain the plasmas. But this has some certain problems with instabilities. So it's been compared to trying to hold jello with rubber bands. Uh, it's very difficult to, to hold a plasma like that for very long. Another option, which is what I worked on, is called inertial confinement fusion. And in this instance, you basically have a pellet of fuel and you bombard it on all sides by some sort of a driver. So normally this is lasers, but lasers also have their own issues. And so what I was looking into was using ion beams to do this instead. So taking these beams of heavy ions like lead and actually compressing the pellet such that it implodes to such a degree that it starts doing fusion in the center and then you get net energy out of that.